Hey, Demon Driver here, and uh, here's the current progress and current status of my customer's scratch-built Gulfstream G650, currently being built by yours truly, Demon Driver. Uh, I have to apologize, my neighbor is uh, cleaning his pool, and he's got a pressure washer going, so hopefully you guys can hear me. This, uh, of this build, um, he wants a very uh, unique livery on this bird that I'm uh, applying. Uh, a black tail, all black tail as you can see. T-tails all black, gloss black. Um, I've got the lower tail done. Uh, that wraps around and there's some like black flames that come up. So I've yet to add those. Um, pretty much he's about 85 to 90 percent completed. All I need to do is just, uh, I've painted the uh, flight controls, the ailerons, flaps, um, elevators, rudder. I just need to install them and then I need to add her, uh, her servos um, and then do a little bit more testing and then she's good to go. So uh, the library is really coming out well. The red really, it's a, it's a cherry red. It's a really, really beautiful cherry red, and it really pops, as you can see. It really looks good. And, uh, I mean, look at that. Tell me that that, that does not look cool. Um, I have not yet added the wing, wing mounting bolts yet, so the uh, fuse is just uh, mocked up on the... Uh, the fuse is just mocked up on the wing, so I've got to add those bolts. We've got to do that next. So she really, I mean, this is this is some of my good. This is good work here. I have to admit, this is some of my, this is some of my better scratch building work. Um, so Shane, my man, I hope you really like what you see here. She's coming along. She's coming along. She's running a little late, but. Uh, I say better late than never, but not only that, I, if you want quality, you got to just sometimes you have to be a little bit patient. You can't, uh, if you rush, sometimes all you come up with is, uh, is junk, especially in the RC scratch building world. You got to take your time. You got to be methodical and take your time and, and, uh, and not rush because that just, it just doesn't work. So she's coming along well. Her EDFs, her twin 50 millimeters are fitted. Um, she's got her speed controllers in there. I mean, you saw her do her taxi test. Her The uh, nacelles were modified. You got the bigger air inlets and exhaust ports. Um, so really all I really have to do is just add her uh, flaps, ailerons, elevators, rudder, uh, pop her nose gear back in, nose gear doors, mount the uh, wing mounting bolts, um, battery straps for the two uh, four cell 14 volt batteries, uh, you know, get all the flight controls in, add all the servos for the ailerons, flaps, two servos up there for the, um, for the elevators, and yeah, and the rudder as well and nose gear steering. Um, the main retracts, the main gears are actually, the main fuse gears are mechanical because they're just too small. They're, um, there's nothing small enough on the serverless side for this girl. So I had to go with uh, mechanical, but a serverless uh, nose retract. So uh, yeah, so I'd say she's 85%, 90% complete. And uh, yeah, she's coming along really good. So Shane, you're gonna have this girl uh, hopefully sometime in July. She should be heading heading your way, packed up and uh, packed up and heading your way, buddy. Yes, indeed, she's really uh, really coming along, man. As you can see, so you're you're gonna love her, man. She's gonna be something really unique and really a lot of fun. Well, this is Demon Driver, and uh, guys, God bless, and Shane, your patience is, uh, is definitely going to pay off in the end, buddy.